Hello everybody, a uh, bit of an early stream today as you guys probably noticed because uh, I got a busy day ahead of me. Gonna be turning in some applications for a place, hopefully we can get accepted so we can move. Uh, but yeah, that's why we got an early stream because I'm gonna be pretty busy today. But hopefully you guys don't mind the stream being a little bit earlier than normal. How's everybody doing? How's everybody doing? Yeah, that's unfortunate, Elias. What a one to miss. Just got my first great one, Whitetail, a few minutes ago. About to post it into Discord. Nice, tough. That's awesome, dude. Also, welcome back. It's good to see you. It's good to see you, man. Alright, so nothing there. Oh, once again, as always, we're going to show our map before we start so you guys can see the hunting pressure. Doing uh, as many efforts as I can to, like show whether or not I've done progress on the map with how crazy those two super rares were it's got me wanting to like give you guys extra ways to verify that everything's legit as even I was like whoa really so from now on I am gonna be showing my map at the beginning and end of every stream so you guys can see exactly where we pick up and leave off don't see anything over there just a uh, way for the newer people to verify. Seems the same as yesterday? Exactly, because I haven't played Call of the Wild since yesterday. After the stream, I jumped on Ark and played that. Oh yeah, Elias, I know. But it's mainly for people that are somewhat new to the channel that may not really know too much about uh, my grinding habits and stuff like that. It's mainly for the people that would have questions. Oh, wait. Ah, uh, there we go. I was gonna say, I just saw the spotting thing pop up. I'd question you. I knew it, Caitlin. I knew it. Well, there's some. Whoa, they were hidden, like, way back there. Decent buck, too. Those guys were way hidden. Okay, I think we got most of them. Yeah, Sam, we got an early stream today. I've got a busy day today, so I decided to go live earlier than normal. And plus, this will give some people that don't normally get to watch a chance to stop by, which is nice. Thanks, Elias. I'm glad you like it. That was uh, created by the amazing Hollow Crow. Excuse me, sir. Say excuse me, please. <laughs> I mean, that's a little bit better, Hector, right? And last time that uh, you were in here, wasn't it like 2 a.m. or something for you? So that's uh, that's much better. Maybe I'll do one of these early streams uh, once a week or something like that. That way it uh, gives uh, people that are on other parts of the world a chance to watch hey Robert how's it going how long did it take to get my first white tail great one uh roughly four thousand or no I think it was three thousand seven hundred and fifty kills if I'm not mistaken it took a long time not on Mondays I beg you uh, don't worry Kyla this is this is a one-time thing for it being on a Monday this was just, unfortunately, the, the way that it worked out for my schedule. If we do uh, streams like this in the future, it'll probably be a different day. Uh, we're most likely going to be changing up the schedule to kind of fit more with not only the type of content that I want to do, but also the type of content that you guys want to see. So there will be some changes to my schedule very soon. Um, probably once we get moved, it'll... I guess like even out a little bit 
But right now, until we get moved into a new place, there's probably going to be a little bit less videos. 239, that's a good buck. Probably going to be slightly less videos, but I'm going to try and make them higher quality. Because it seems like that is what people are voting for the most on the poll I put up this morning is that and then also just to do whatever is best for me. So we'll uh, we'll see but there's definitely going to be some changes to the schedule. Because with the current schedule of keeping like daily videos and five streams a week it's just really difficult to keep up with that and also my IRL stuff. Like between taking care of Aaliyah and trying to find a place to get into and like all the other life things you know like that combined with all the all the videos and streams has made it very hard to balance all that out so depending on what the poll what people say on the poll there's probably gonna be slightly less videos but they'll be better quality more of the type of stuff you guys want to see like uh, challenges random wheel videos like things like that the stuff that I've seen you guys ask for the most hey Wyatt how's it going hey beastie hey Sam you guys have not missed anything yet yeah hopefully Kyla I hope they do and uh, thank you for that hopefully they do go well this place seems really nice so we're hoping that they will accept the applications you know the hardest part is just providing proof of income as a YouTube content creator because it's not like considered a, an official like job by most people it is so hard to verify yeah that'd be cool BC I don't think that'd be too difficult either that would probably be a pretty easy change to make. Yeah, sure, Sam. Go for it. Go for it. Yeah, Kyle, it's, uh, it's not easy as a content creator to try and get into places and stuff like that. Because a lot of times they, they expect, like, you know, a normal, like, pay stub or something like that as a proof of income. But when you do YouTube, you don't get a pay stub. So most places just require you to do, like, bank statements or things like that. And even, like, even sometimes that doesn't really work out so hopefully uh, hopefully this place will be understanding of the uh, limitations there we go Oh yeah, it, it definitely is, Kyla. It's it's wild. Um, me and Bree did ours like a week and a half, two weeks ago, and my gosh, it was a tough process. This was the first year that we had uh, done taxes with both being self-employed, so it was not fun. It was like four or five hours of questioning whether or not we were getting everything right, uh, talking to like the TurboTax professionals, and then eventually finally getting to a point where we think everything was in line and we, you know, got our questions answered for the most part. It's, it's not a fun process at all. <laughs> it's not a fun process. Like, at this point, I think that, I think next year we might just hire a professional to do it for us because it is such a hassle. Oh, uh, Wyatt, thank you for the super chat, dude. Really appreciate it. Mess up a diamond. I ain't messing up a diamond for $2, but I do appreciate the super chat, dude. 
Do appreciate it. We might try to take a diamond with a uh, abnormal weapon, though, if you'd want to see that. But thank you for the super chat. We got a few over there. And a couple here. They're pretty spread out today. There we go. Perfect. Wyatt, thank you for another super chat. Now mess up a diamond. Well, you know, at this point, I think I might have to. I think I might have to. I'm probably not going to do it with a white tail because I want to keep my count accurate and not uh, throw myself off in the future, but you know what I'll do? I'll do a YouTube short of me just pumping 22 ammunition into a mountain lion. Because if it's a mountain lion, I won't feel bad about it. <laughs> but thank you for the super chat again, dude. Appreciate it. Nice, Sam. Nice. Yeah, Christian, no worries, dude. I had a little bit of a, uh, a schedule change for today because I've got some stuff to do later. But I am going to try and do a couple early streams in the future as well to kind of give you guys some different options for, like, viewing times. Super close, Sam. Super close. Super close, man. Uh, yes, Wars. This is just going to be a white tail stream. I really want to get that great one number five down, so most of the streams are going to be doing whitetail. I really want to get this fifth one. If you have hunting pressure at a zone, the animals won't spawn, right? Yes, that is correct. Shadow sees ducks in the creek. About to witness murder. Oh, no. Oh, no, Shadow. Don't do it. How do you take the item out of your hand? On PC, just hit the H key. I don't know what it would be on console, but on PC, just hit the H. And one more deer. I hope so, Swars. I hope so. Would be great if we could get it. What time is it for me? It's currently 10.58 a.m. Where did we shoot this other one? Looks like down here. Oh, that's so they don't fly off, uh, Kyla. You clip the wings so that they can't fly out of their pen or wherever they have them. Like, um, we used to do it with some of our chickens that would fly out of the, that would fly out of the pen and try to run away. Basically, when you just clip the tips of the feathers, it just makes it so they can't fly out of their pen. Yep, 
Yeah, I do, Wyatt. I do indeed. Good old Oregon. Nothing here. Wow. I see absolutely nothing. That's wild. Oh, that's unfortunate, Kyla. Uh, no, monkey. I've not seen whitetail in real life. There's not really whitetail around here too much. It's mainly blacktail deer and mule deer in Oregon. I uh, know, Constantine. You didn't miss much. We just started, like, maybe 15 minutes ago. And we have yet to shoot anything too crazy. Nothing too crazy today. Oh gosh, Kyla. Well, that's wild. Those poor things. Yeah, me too, Sam. I'd like to see some new trophy lodges as well. The question is, like, what type of lodge would we like to see? I'd like to see one larger than Tzatziki Safari if it's possible. Give us, like, a mega lodge of some kind. Give us, like, a, a Jumbo Bass Pro Shops Cabela style lodge. Well, it looks like we found where all the deer are. Would be cool to have a Warthog Great One. I'm curious what they would even do for a Warthog Great One. So I'm absolutely new to have a city whitetail a couple days ago. Amazed me that it was not dead. You know, a lot of times the ones that live in the city get really smart and just learn to avoid traffic. It's kind of crazy. Like, some of them get really smart and they just use the city as a way to avoid hunters and stuff like that. So some of those bucks that live in the city end up getting huge. Yes, that would be amazing, Caitlin. That would be amazing. Apparently, Ultimate Hunting is going to let you choose where you want to put your mounts. Which, that's kind of crazy. I hope that's true. I really hope that is what they're going to do. Because that would be amazing. Alright, I think that's about all we're going to be able to get from here. Unless we can get her. One shot in a dream. One shot in a dream. Didn't get it. <laughs> Fail. Hey Mel, how's it going? Oh really Johnny? That's awesome. How long until next map is releasing? No clue, monkey. They don't really tell us anything until it's like a couple weeks before release. Typically it would be in June, so I wouldn't expect a map anytime soon. Hey, Scarator, or was it Flint Crow? Ah, uh, yes. How's it going, man? How's it going? If they could do it, anyone can. True. Unless Call of the Wild's jumbled code prevents them from doing so. Uh, not on stream, Rylan. I don't uh, do it on stream. I try to keep my content as family friendly as possible. Alright, let's get down here. 
My favorite lake. Can this just give us another super rare, please? That'd be great. Albino this time, or melanistic, please. That'd be lovely. Or a great one, you know, I'd take that too. And... Okay, not exactly what I was hoping to see. But you know, there's a lot of deer, so that makes up for it. I'll take a high quantity of deer. That's at least a good thing. So we should be able to... Get quite a few of them here. Yeah, there's a ton. Look at all of them just bunched up like that. That's awesome. Oh, that doe lifted her head and it completely ruined that. No. We could have had so many down there, but that doe lifted her head, man. Unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Well, if we can get him. And him. And her. And her. Oh, same one, actually. And somehow missed that one. Not sure how. Rip. Yep, that one's probably going to run a ways. Imagine. Nope. There we go. He's dead. <laughs> Not great, but you know what? We got them at least. It wasn't pretty, but we got them. Just got another rare needed in Planet Zoo for the project. Nice, Mel. Nice. Hey, Lewis, how's it going, dude? Oh, also, guys, I'm thinking about possibly doing another Pokemon stream tonight. Thinking about jumping back on Legends of Arceus once I get back home. So I think what I'm going to do with it, too, is I've just been playing through the story and stuff on my own time. And I think that what I'm going to stream is I'm just going to stream like shiny hunting and stuff like that, because I find that to be the most enjoyable thing to play. I've always uh, enjoyed that more than playing through the storyline of a Pokemon game, so... Probably going to stream like shiny hunting or something like that. Because that is probably my favorite part of uh, playing the Pokemon games is the shiny hunting. I don't know, just searching for rare things is something I always enjoy in any game, really. Um, somewhat, Blake. It's mainly through donations and memberships uh, during live streams. But there's a lot of very generous people in the community, so usually it still works out. Just rushed a shot on a level 5 muley. Oh no, Sam. Oh no. You shouldn't have done that, man. Yeah, that is very strange, Johnny. You've got like two of the hardest to get super rares, and then I've got a bunch of piebald super rares. <laughs> Yeah, Blake, we have like the super chats, the super stickers, the uh, don't, or the um, memberships, things like that. Hey, Westosaurus, how's it going, man? Glad to see you. Oh, that's not good, Keller. I hope you feel better soon. Yeah, 
Anybody know if you reset your skills and perks at level 60, you can earn skills and points back? Uh, so basically when you click reset, it doesn't delete your skills and perks. What it does is it gives you all the points back. That way you can redistribute them to whatever you want. But there is no way to earn more skill points. Like, whatever you get at level 60, that's the limit of how many skill points you can get. But if you reset them, it just gives you all the points back so you can redistribute them however you like. So you're not going to lose anything by resetting them. Got a diamond albino alligator. Nice, Marky. That's awesome. That's a very rare trophy. Gotta be close to this one. Ooh, feels bad, Caitlin. You gotta sacrifice a couple, uh, couple skills you're used to using then. That's what I had to do. I, if I remember right, the one that I sacrificed was, uh, Disturb Vegetation. I don't use Disturb Vegetation because I can just, like, check the map for, uh, fur type. So that's what I ended up doing, but a lot of times you got to sacrifice a couple perks that you uh, enjoy using, or I guess a couple skills. Yeah, I would probably do that, Caitlin, because like right now, to serve vegetation is not like a necessary perk, since you can just pick up a track and check your map. That might change in the future if they ever fix that, though. But it'll probably be a while before they fix it since that's not really a top priority bug. So you should be fine for at least a couple months. Oh yeah, it definitely is, Caitlin. It's nice having that extra weight limit. Pack Mule is a lifesaver having an extra three units. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, that makes sense. Do you live in Layton? No. Layton is based in Washington, not Oregon. I mean, it, it, obviously Washington and Oregon are very similar, but... If I remember right, Layton is based off Washington. So it seems like once again these deer are not going to come out, which means they're probably at the far end. A lot of times they'll be like right here or further down that way. We'll see. Hopefully Davis, hopefully that great one will show up and you'll be better. Well, currently Panda, it's 11:12 a.m. What's my rarest red deer? Hmm. I don't know. It's between the great one and my mythical albino. Those are probably my two rarest. All right, where's the deer? Come on, show yourselves. Is there even deer at this lake anymore? There actually might be zero deer here. We might have to hunt some other zones uh, for a while until we get deer back here. Yeah, it looks like we're going to have to, so I guess uh, back to La Hacienda. Let's go ahead and reset the time and then go there. Zero deer zone. Yeah, it's uh, un unfortunate. Very unfortunate. If only it was 12-12. I mean, it was for a second. It's 11, or no, never mind. It was it was 11-11, wasn't it? We've decided on the new map, Flinter's Backyard. <laughs> I'm, uh, to be honest, I think a lot of people would like a Pennsylvania map. It seems like uh, the Call of the Wild community's got a lot of people from PA.
How many legendary crows do I have? I think one. One or two. Wait, which tier is which tier is legendary crow? Is that the $25 tier? I always get the names mixed up even though I'm the one that named them. There we go, we got one there. One there. Okay, not what I'm wanting to see. Two solo zones, not the greatest. Oh, actually, it's a double zone. Beautiful. How are you not vitally hit? Ooh, sorry guys, I had to mute for a second so I could sneeze. I caught it just in time. Okay, where'd that other one go? Is it alive still? I don't think so. I think we're good. I'm gonna guess that there's a lot of deer like right where we are. There's probably a zone like somewhere here or here and once we fast travel away it should render in. Probably Elias, probably. At six months you should get the red badge. I knew it. I knew there was more deer. There's two there. Still not as many as I thought we'd be seeing. Oh, there they are. There they are. They're all just kind of tucked away in that brush. Well, at least we can see more of them. Ooh, there we go. I'll take it. That was a decent shot. No, I'm not going to get that last one. Oh, she's dead. Okay, I think we're good. I think that was all of them. Hey, James, how's it going, dude? Yeah, the quail are cool. Yeah, grouse would be awesome. Would definitely like that. Plus, they reuse like four or five species. Yeah, they always reuse a few and then add about the same amount. Yeah, flow for sure. That's my number one want for a map. Uh, I actually talked about that recently in one of the videos. Yeah, that's my number one want for a map. Give me my beaver revenge, please. Let us smoke the beavers. They need to hurry up and add them. I think everybody's uh, getting tired of waiting for those beavers. We need them. Alright, it looks like nothing else has shown up. Oh. I stand corrected. I stand corrected. Wow. Right as I say nothing else has showed up. We have two more deer. Yeah, that'd be cool, uh, Marquis. I would like to see horses get added one day. Yeah, I don't know why they haven't, Kyla. It is kind of strange. My guess is they'll probably do it in the future. They're probably focusing on other things first. Because I feel like if they add pheasants to Hirschfelden, it would probably come with a map rework, right? Like, I feel like it would come with a map rework. Kind of like they've done to, you know, Leighton and Verhonga and Rancho and maps like that. I feel like it would come with a map rework. 
because they would have to change a bunch of spawn points around and zones around because of the pheasants. So that's probably why it's been pushed off if I were to take a guess. Uh, this is Rancho Del Arroyo. What is the best map? I mean, it really just comes down to what you enjoy the most. My favorite is uh, Silver Ridge Peaks with Rancho being a... Or with Verhonga being second. And then... Or no. I forgot what my own order was. That is... <laughs> is that... Is that is that true, Marky? Did did she actually say that? If so, that's just a blatant lie. If so, that's just a blatant lie. Because we don't get maps until June. They release maps in June and December. And it's always been like that. They don't have any intentions of straying away from that schedule. And I'm a weirdo that thinks parquet is the best. <laughs> hey, like, like I was saying, it's whatever you enjoy the most. That's the best map. Whatever map you enjoy hunting the most is the best map, you know? Okay, gotcha, Slawzix. Yeah, that makes more sense. I was going to say there's absolutely no way that we would get a map next month or this month. It would be in June at the very minimum. I'm doing pretty good, Poob. Doing pretty good. Just smoking as many whitetail as I can. Is there really two more over here? Oh yeah. There's one. And apparently there's one other we missed. Although I think we barely wounded her, so she's probably really far away. What rack am I hoping for on this great one? I'm hoping to get the typical looking rack or the drop tine rack. Either of those I would be very happy with. Uh, yeah, Davis, typically. They typically put out teasers for a map like a month or so before it comes out. We usually start seeing, like, teasers for a new map two to four weeks before the release. In most cases. There is, uh, variables, of course, but for the most part we see teasers two to four weeks before a release. Yes, Johnny, please. Please. My favorite species to hunt is the red deer, uh, Rocco's. Uh, level 60 Call of the Wild Gaming. And also, try not to repeat. Give me some time to reply before putting another message in. Jeez. Decent buck. I want to spot that one in the middle, but I can't. Oh, we got a decent amount of deer here. I don't know if we'll be able to get all of them before they spook off, so... That's going to be a little unfortunate. I'd like to take all these out. That's a big deer. That's a really big deer. I think that's actually diamond potential, if I'm not mistaken. I think that's a diamond rack. I can't tell, though, because I can't see it straight on yet. It looks like the diamond rack, though. That's a big boy right there. That is a big boy. Wow, what a giant. Oh yeah, that's Diamond Rack. That's gotta be right. Yes, that, that's Diamond Rack. Okay. 
Uh, that is definitely a diamond level two. No doubt about it. The tip to tip spread is crazy. That thing's gonna make diamond. I guarantee it. I can about guarantee this guy will make it. What do I have with me? I have the 22 Hornet with me. Oh no. Well, so much for 22 trick. Can't really do that. So we're just gonna have to wait for him to come back. There he is, right there. Look at that beast. Oh my gosh. What a giant. Why did it have to stop right there? Why did it have to stop right there? Big boy, but what is a super? A super is a super rare. There's just, unfortunately, not enough uh, space in a YouTube title to put super rare, so I have to put super. I mean, I guess I could put SR, but then that would still confuse people, so... Yeah. Where is this thing? It stopped right over here, right? I think it did, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, Nightbot's not a person, uh, Farmer Joe. And it's because you put too many exclamation points. That's what happened. Nightbot saw that as excessive. Yeah, they, do, they don't add stuff for content creators, Marquee. They don't uh, cater to what we want in the game. It's more of what the community wants as a whole. So nothing that one creator says will ever change anything in the game. The devs have a uh, have a plan for the game and uh, nothing us content creators say changes like the plan, you know? It's more based on the wide feedback from the whole community. Uh, maybe, Johnny. Still, I think we would run into the same problem of not having enough room. I used the full max 100 of 100 characters for today's title, so yeah. Look at that beauty. Do we try the next shot? It would be so risky. I don't think we'll do the next shot. That seems a bit too risky. With that weird angle, at least. Let's just move a little bit. That should get him to lift his head and start walking a bit. Wow, look at that beast. Come on, turn broadside for us. Turn broadside for us, man. I mean, I could take that shot, it's just a little bit risky. There we go. We did it. There we go. Beautiful. Diamond number one of the day. At least I'm, I'm pretty sure that's a diamond. I, I couldn't see it not being a diamond. Look at that giant. Look at the tip to tip spread. This has to be like a 261. 259.60, close. That's a big deer. Oh my gosh, we hit. What? Ugh. Okay, I don't like that. That was, that was not a, wow. That could have been bad. That could have been really bad. I don't know how we actually got that. 
I, I waited for like a, a somewhat safe shot and we still ended up getting a really risky hit. You still did a neck shot, I know, right? Even when I'm not trying to, we still do neck shots. Flinter would be proud. Alright, well, let's uh, go ahead and move on. Because we got a few different deer that we need to claim over here. The neck is a magnet. It definitely seems that way. I'll probably celebrate vampire. We definitely have to do some kind of celebration stream or something. Oh yeah, true Johnny, definitely. I've noticed that with the 30-06 as well, or not the 30-06, but the M1, which I guess, I guess the M1 is a 30-06 of sort, but yeah, I've noticed that with the M1 it does that occasionally too. It's really odd. Thank you, Call the Wild Gaming. I appreciate that, dude. Hey, Giant Carlo. Yeah, Sam. That poor thing. Just got smoked right in the neck. Had no chance. That's a sheep zone. There was deer over here yesterday, but I don't see any today. So we probably uh, deleted that zone and had them move. Yeah, Blake, I think it was just, uh, just unlucky inaccuracy from the 308. I guess like Johnny was saying, sometimes it hits low, sometimes it hits high in his experience, so it was probably just something like that. Hey, Kai, how's it going? I appreciate the uh, kind words, man. And it, it's it's difficult at times, but the fact that um, both my wife and I work from home, that helps it out a lot. I think that's probably the biggest thing. But yeah, it can be difficult at times. Normally it's like fine and there's not really any uh, any issues with doing consistent streams and videos and stuff like that while also making time for family, but uh, right now since we're trying to move, it's a little more hectic. Uh, just taking care of Aaliyah and working whenever I get off of streams and stuff like that. That's uh, pretty much been it, Kyla. Our lives right now are work, 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 take care of Aaliyah. Work, 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 take care of Aaliyah. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at that herd. That is, that is exactly what we want to see. Beautiful. What a sight. All those beautiful deer over there. Uh, Wyatt, thank you for the super chat again, dude. 48 diamonds for 48k subs. Oh, man. Like a video of 48 diamonds? That would be wild. I don't know if I could even accomplish that for one video. Eight kids, ten out of ten, don't recommend. <laughs> 
Yeah, I'm, I'm fine with one kid. All we need is Aaliyah. And then we're good to go. I could not imagine uh, having to take care of two kids while balancing streaming videos, all that type of stuff. That'd be wild. Uh, Riptide, thank you for renewing your membership. Dude, two months in a row. What's up, man? Sorry, been super busy and missing streams. Been working and making a kayak trailer. Oh, nice, dude. Nice. That's awesome. It sounds like you've been uh, having fun. And also, I didn't realize you could add a message to your, like, uh, monthly um, membership message. That's cool. Well, I guess for anybody that didn't know, you can attach a message whenever you use up your special super chat message. You can actually add on to it. That's cool. I didn't realize that. I guess you learn something new every day. That's cool. <laughs> yeah, Sam. It's it's something you get used to though. It was definitely tough at first, which is why I didn't stream and make videos as much during that time, but honestly after a while you just get in a groove and it just becomes like second nature, just becomes natural. I think that's all of them. I think that's all the deer. Uh, a little over 10 months, uh, Poob. My daughter's about 10 and a half months old. What's a trophy rating for Diamond Whitetail? 255 is the trophy rating. Oh, you're not graduated yet. <laughs> oh my gosh, Sam. That's great. That's great. Also, um, I'm going to send you a message in Discord real quick, Sam. I want to ask you a question real quickly. There we go. Oh, Sam's in trouble. Nah, Sam, nah, Sam's not in trouble, JN. <laughs> Sam's fine. Yeah, Kyla. You never know. You never know. Shot a diamond caribou yesterday and a diamond wild boar. Nice, dude. That's awesome. Nice. All right. In one second. All right, there we go. There we go. Actually, you can take my place. <laughs> yeah, you'll have you'll have some days off now, Kyla. 236, that's a good deer. Broke the top of my finger, got 10 stitches, huge weight on me. On me, one in it, on it, it was 134 pounds. Jeez, Oski. That's rough, dude. It's rough. It's really rough. Yeah, Airsoft, that was a pretty decent buck. Not bad. Unlimited power! <laughs> Thank you. 
Oh, let me let me give you the rank in Discord as well so that you can see the YouTube moderator chat. I can find you in here. Okay, Discord, thank you. Amazing. I swear, Discord is terrible at finding people that are in the server. Wait, wait, wait a second. What happened to David's ranks? <laughs> what happened to David? What's going on here? Uh, Sam, if you could, could you, uh, put a message in one of the... Chats. Actually, you're in the Pokemon one, right? Yeah, I think you are. There we go. There we go. I found you. There we go. Sweet. What happened to David's ranks in Discord, though? That's a little weird. He has absolutely no ranks. What happened? Uh, sometimes, Dan. I usually switch the time first and then go to the main menu. Because uh, a lot of times that'll make it so the deer are like immediately back in their zones. Yeah, Sam. For sure. Oh, jeez, Blake, that's wild, man. Can we get in there, maybe? That didn't work. That, that did not work at all. <laughs> or did it? I mean, it's losing health. Glad you enjoy the content, Poob. Glad you enjoy it. That might be a diamond, I think. Maybe. Alright, Kyla, no worries. Have fun with that. I don't think that's a diamond, but just in case it is, we'll definitely take it down. I can't tell if that's the diamond rack or the one below it. It might be the one below it, because it is shaped a little bit weird. It's so hard to tell at certain angles. Oh my gosh, was that a headshot? I think we either head or neck shot that. Uh, for the longest time, I did have a schedule poo, but recently it's been pretty random with all the extra stuff I've been having to do, trying to get moved and... Uh, just trying to spend a little bit more time with my daughter and stuff like that. But I used to have a schedule that was pretty solid, and now it's kind of... It kind of varies a little bit from day to day. Alright, let's grab this buck, and then... I gotta send David a message real quick. I gotta see what happened. I gotta see why his ranks are missing.
I gotta see what happened to his roles in Discord. It's so strange. He spoke about Fight Club. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hey Jackalus, how's it going? You missed the diamond level two. Let's see. Definitely not the diamond rack. Yeah, 237. Good buck, but not a diamond at all. But very solid deer. One of the really cool looking deer. Oof, 216. Another good one. What do I think is the best map? For me personally, I like Silver Ridge Peaks the most. Muskox would be amazing, Sam. Like, Muskox would be great. You probably could, Johnny. I would not doubt it one bit. Seems pretty plausible. Hey, Dylan, you missed a diamond. It was a 259 scoring level 2 whitetail. That's been about it so far, though. Solo doe, though. Today's been a little bit slower, like, uh, quantity-wise, though. Like, I'm noticing we're not seeing as many deer as we did yesterday. Which is a little unfortunate. A little bit concerning, but... It'll probably pick up again. Solo doe, though. It's always those solo doe, those, man. How the saw was invented? <laughs> I hope that's not how they invented it. Come on, give us the goods! Will we have a big male down here? Or a big female? Either would do. I'd take a rare female at this point. Doe? Buck? Doe. Yeah, I think we're in a bit of a lull. We're kind of at a point where some of our respawns aren't at their lakes, so... We might have to do a quick hop to the main menu and then jump back in for the next run. Because there's definitely some that are not showing up at their zones, which is a little bit unfortunate. Yeah, that'd be cool, Hunter. That would be cool, man. Solo ho -ho, though. <laughs> Perfect. How close are you to the uh, the shadow, the apex shadow Lugia, Sam? I am almost done with page two of the research. It has, uh, it's been rough doing the whole like earn a heart with your buddy 30 days in a row. I'm at 27 of 30 right now. I'm gonna be really sad if I miss out on one of them. I say in ways it is, uh, Cody. Primarily just because you can use mouse and keyboard, which is a little bit easier to get accurate shots with. Halfway through that task, ooh, unfortunate. I'm guessing you missed a day or two then. That's rough. I started it like the second it was available. I think it took me like two or three days to get to the uh, task. And then I've, I've kept my streak going ever since. Yeah, Dylan, I do. Not recently, but when I was growing up I did. All right, we'll check this lake, and then we'll probably go to the main menu. 
Oh, the 100 field research tasks. Yeah, that's a tough one. That's right. I was getting, I think, like 10, 10 to 15 done at the most in a day. But most of the time, I'd get like seven done. In most cases, it'd be like seven a day. So yeah, I forgot about that task. That did take a long time. Wyatt, welcome to the Scarecrew, dude. Enjoy the green name and chat, the special badge icon, all the awesome emotes, ability to use commands, access to private Discord channels once you link Discord to YouTube, and access to my scrapped content on the channel. Really appreciate that. Jeez, Sam. Yeah, it's it's not an it's not a quick task, that's for sure. Especially if you live in an area where there's not a lot of Poke Stops, which I'm lucky that I've got a few near me. So like every day I can complete, you know. If I wanted to, I can complete like 10 field research every day. A little bit more if I walk further. <laughs> yeah, Johnny. <laughs> they will be one of these days whenever uh, gifting memberships is a thing. Uh, we're talking about Pokemon Go. Johnny has caps. Ban, ban, ban. You're out of here, Johnny. So many capital letters. What is this? What does the XD at some at the end of some comments mean? It's like a face, you know, like a, I guess like a smile face or something like that. Like kind of like a, I guess like a happy chuckle, a really happy smile, something like that, you know. Hey Nina, how's it going? You missed a diamond. We had a diamond level two white tail. So far, that's been the only good buck on the day. All right, I think we're actually gonna have to end it, guys, because it is getting close to when we were planning on leaving, so. I appreciate you all uh, dropping in. We will be back um, tomorrow with another live stream. Extreme Dougie. Yes, that's exactly what it means. But anyway, guys, really appreciate you guys stopping by. It's been fun as always. And yeah, I will see you all in the next one. Peace.